Hi, everybody! Hi, Jill. Welcome to our first Game of Thrones season 8 predictions video. We're kicking off our final season's predictions with none other than Arya Stark. <laughs> and all our predictions are not based on any leaks, any spoilers, any reports, just the story and our imagination. I know death. He's got many faces. I look forward to seeing this one. And in every prediction video, I'm also going to predict the last shot of each character. So Arya Stark. Okay. She has been training for a long time. This has been building up. Mm -hmm. She has to put her skills to some incredible use. Mm -hmm. Not just some killing little finger, that's, that's not enough. Something extraordinary. There's a theory out there that she might be the one to kill the Night King. I don't think so. I think she's going to kill Daenerys. Daenerys? She's going to kill Daenerys. Interesting. Tell me a bit more about that. <laughs> <laughs> so how will she do it? Mm -hmm. It has to be faceless man style, right? This is why I don't think it will be the Night King. She has to use her skills, being able to disguise herself as somebody else, coming close and do a clean kill. That's not the way I think that the Night King is going to die. Maybe she could not only kill Daenerys, but also kill Drogon, her dragon. I think the contrast between the humongous dragon and the small, very fast, Arya armed with a needle, a needle that can go into the eye, that's a weak spot mm -hmm. for the dragons. Just imagining this battle unfolding, her against a dragon, going this way and that way. But, but what's her motivation to kill Daenerys and the dragon? Why, why would she do that? Okay, first of all, Daenerys has to die this season, last episode or episode before last. And one of the reasons that she has to die is that she has to make room for Sansa to be the queen. Arya is working for Sansa. Maybe Sansa will manipulate her in some way of seeing Daenerys as a threat to the Starks, everything that the Starks have built. Which fell is yours, your grace? Are you a Stark or are you not? Jon is over there, but he's not a Stark. I think Arya will be manipulated by Sansa. Sansa will give her Daenerys' name and she will think that she's doing something for the greater good, for her family. Maybe she will even think that Jon is on board or will be on board. And I think that once that she does it and then she realizes what she has done, that will be too much for her and she will just be a nomad, homeless, nameless go into a voluntary exile. I mean, if Daenerys and Jon are together mm -hmm. and uh, they love each other, blah, 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 and Daria loves and Jon. Queen. Yeah, king and queen. Arya loves Jon, like he's one of her favorite brothers. Yes. Daenerys is his chosen one, then why would she want to do that? <laughs> <laughs> Does she have to kill someone? She has to kill she someone. She has to kill someone. Like she you said, yeah, I agree that her skills must somehow come into action in a very very meaningful way mm -hmm. right not some just like whatever killing this dude or that dude mm -hmm, or just mm -hmm. killing lots of zombies right that's not the thing so why not Cersei or someone uh... okay so I read a theory on reddit that if you look in the books at, at Arya's list of names some of them are in italic and some of them are regular mm -hmm. and those that are in italic are either dead or going to die, but not by Arya's hands. Mm -hmm. And those that are written regular font, this is science, mm. 
Arya has killed them or will kill them. Mm -hmm. Cersei's name is in italic. And I don't think that, uh, that Arya will kill Cersei. I think that Jaime will kill Cersei. Yeah, mm -hmm. I think so too. So I think if we know that Sansa wants to be queen, mm -hmm. and if we assume that in order to become queen, she will have to do something very malicious, very conniving, Tywin Lannister-like, use the people around her, it, because she ha I think she will be left alone by the end, be a ruling queen, soul queen, without her family and her friends. Mm -hmm. she, will have to she will have to lose her starkness. So I think this, e this fits very well all these points. She will do something incredible, kill Daenerys, maybe even Drogon, with a needle in the eye, a small child, water dancing mm -hmm. against this huge fire. The only person, maybe, maybe, that can kill a dragon is this little girl that can just jump around and be quicker than him. Is the Bravos dance. The water dance. It is swift and sudden. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Not an army or something like that. Maybe it's like from uh, The Princess Bride when uh, the giant uh, can't uh, hit Wesley because he's used yeah. to fighting against uh, a dozen people at a time. Also a bit like uh, the mountain fighting... Uh, uh, what's his name? Ah, the Viper. And what do you think about her ending up in a sort of uh, voluntary ex exile? She has no room, no name, no mm -hmm. identity, so she's going to go west. Yeah, I mean, I think that uh, I agree that she she's shedding her starkness. Yes. In the way that she's become a faceless man. Crazy. A crazy. Psycho. And, uh, maybe she'll become like a uh, Jackin, like this kind of like, uh, maybe she will be in this kind of like a uh, house. Go of, back though, going back. That's, I don't know if it works uh, story-wise. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And also I think that each character, I've said it a million times, each character has to pay the most significant price for them personally. Mm -hmm. So for her, it's being a Stark. When she faced off with Jacket. Finally, a girl is Noah. A girl is Arya Stark of Winterfell. And I'm going home. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But then, if she loses that, if there's nothing more for, the, for her after she will realize what she has done to John and that it is wrong, she will just say, I can't handle it anymore, I, have, I can't stay. Where will I go? I keep thinking about uh, Janis Joplin's uh, line, you know, freedom's just another word for nothing left uh. to lose. I mean, maybe that's part of her. I mean, she always wanted to be free. She always wanted to be right. autonomous. Right. So having nothing left to lose would gain her that. Right. Her dad had, had expectations for her society. Then Jack and Hagar had expectations yeah. for her. Then Sansa will have expectations for her. No, nothing. That's mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. Nothing, yeah. She will just, uh, yeah, travel the world with nothing to lose, and then she will be free. I, I'm still not convinced about Daenerys, I'm okay, sorry. <laughs> okay, so for the, what do you think? But I want to predict the very last shot. Okay, so I think maybe we'll see some character that we don't know, some fisherman or something like that, just doing something fisherman y. Mm -hmm. And then we'll be thinking, why are we watching this character? But then we'll realize that maybe it's Arya, right? With a mask. Uh -huh. yeah, maybe because of Needle or something. And then she'll hop on a boat, head west. Probably Needle will give her away, yeah. Also, the west, I think, has been foreshadowed a bit in uh, Fire and Blood, in a world of ice and fire and all that, that there is something there out west, so I think... Mm -hmm. someone will go there. So maybe the last shot would be someone on the boat, on her boat, asking her her name. And then maybe before she's, like, she'll be thinking, and then cut off to the next person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's her name? Could be? It could be. It could be. Okay, so what do you think? Please mention in the comments or tweet at us at Got Academy and subscribe to get all our predictions videos and if you are already subscribed there's a bell over there that you can click to get notifications each time we post a new video okay so this is a great channel with great content i myself am a patron and i love it and uh, i really invite all of you to join us and uh, just to support everything that gil does and we all do 
with a lot of effort, without any fun. <laughs> so please. <laughs> I approve this message, message except the last part. I think it's the a lot of fun. The please. It's not fun. I said it, I said it, please, and then I said it, and I said it, and I said it, and I said it. All this remains in the video. So thank you everybody for watching. Thank you our patrons. We'll see everybody in our next prediction video coming up very soon. Bye everybody. Bye. Bye.